So the new Galaxy Oppo is Anthony Edwards and I gotta show you guys all the new players. However though, if you're like me and you wanna see 2K put the same effort that they do in packs into free stuff, then like the video right now because take a look at this. They have a whole video. Like imagine if they put the same effort into all the free stuff, my team would be so much better. So you can see the players that we are getting. We gotta take a look at the stats and obviously let me know which player you want the most because they got the whole aura you know, Aura sets with Anthony. That card art is nasty. Oh my, that really is some Aura. James Harden, I literally called James Harden. We knew he was coming at some point. And then Larry the Bird, legend up in here. Bird is the word, if you know where that's from. You already know we're best friends. And my boy Danny Granger also with the Aura Pink Diamond. Is that Dolph right there? That is Dolph. Oh my goodness, that might be cheesy. Then we got Rui up in here as a diamond. Yo, they literally have a whole video for the packs. Like, they put work into this. Like, they put money into this. And, like, you know, it'd be nice if they did that, too. You know, free stuff. You know, 2K, do you remember locker codes? Any Anyone remember locker codes? What are those? We should be seeing, a uh, you know, an event. And, obviously, with the new packs, we should be getting some deluxe packs, which uh, you definitely want to finish these if you haven't already. I definitely got to finish them. So, we should be seeing, you know, instead of lightning strike, it'll be aura. But, hopefully, we do also get that event. And then, of course, locker codes because... Uh, we desperately need some locker codes. And I'm going to tell you right now, the big brain play with this new set is to wait for the new season because next week, this is the final pack drop of this season for season two. Season three is next week. And on top of that, we should be seeing the events. You know, hopefully 2K hasn't revealed it yet, which is a little, uh, you know, I'm a little worried about that because, you know, they did show off obviously the players, but we should be seeing a My Team Festival. This is why I mentioned, you know, locker codes like, we should be seeing this because with season three literally around the corner, you know, they, they do this basically every year, right? For November, you know, a week before Thanksgiving. So we should be seeing a locker code for Thanksgiving. We should be seeing season three, you know, a week from now. That's why I'm telling you with this set right here, you know, I know some people are going to be like, I want Galaxy Opal Anthony Edwards. I want P9 and James Harden and I want them too. But if you're not, you know, if you're like a no money spent player, the vibe is going to be to make MT. Sell whatever you can, and then, of course, get ready for all the free stuff. And you got to let me know, which player do you want the most? Because we should be seeing free deluxe packs, obviously free players, and hopefully that events that, you know, 2K does every year. Hopefully they do bring out a lot of great free stuff, because if they can make a whole video, look at this. Yo, for a second, I was like, yo, Dark Matters already? That would have been crazy, but also not surprising. But the intro really got me for a second. I was like, yo, but then obviously, you know, Galaxy Elbow, Anthony Edwards. I do want James Harden. I'm going to tell you right now, Harden is the one that I want the most. Now, luckily, with Opals now being in the game, Pink Diamonds are definitely cheaper than what they were, you know, at the beginning of the year versus now. So that's at least something to look forward to. And then, of course, the free stuff. Now, when it comes to his three-pointer, 93, 93 speed, 85 perimeter defense, and 98 driving dunk, of course, 90 speed with the Ball Hall of Fame badges. I do want to see his animations. Because I think starting with uh, Dark Matters, I think that's when they're going to start changing like the release timing. So he's still going to have normal. He's going to have lower upper, you know, obviously his release. The Anthony Edwards dribble style. You know, Kemba Walker escape moves. The only Edwards that I've ever used so far this year has been the free agent one. And, uh, you know, he was definitely moving uh, saucy out there. So he's definitely going to be a cheesy card. But I feel like the odds are definitely going to be. Actually, they might be a little bit more common just because just he is 6'4". You know, every time that 2K releases like a Giants, you know, the odds are even more rare. I feel like with him being 6'4", he might be, you know, I'm not saying he's going to be flying out of packs, but he should be a little bit more common than like the bigger players, right? I wouldn't be surprised if James Harden is going to be more rare than Anthony Edwards. And speaking of James Harden, we got to take a look at exactly how he's looking. So 6'5", he can play the point guard position. So in my opinion, he's already better than Edwards. Would you agree or disagree? I feel like for me, you know, an Opal would be nice to get, but uh, I need me some James Harden. He would easily be my new starting point guard. 6'5", 6'11", wingspan, 90s 5'3", pointer, 92 speed, 82 from our defense. Really wish that was higher, but it is James Harden. You know, 85 driving dunk. Yeah, I think I want him more than Edwards. Is that crazy to say? I don't think it's crazy, right? Because, you know, the James Harden, the Hidden Gems one, I know some people have the Hidden Gems. But this is the diamond one. The one that we're getting is pink diamond. So this is not going to get updated. It's going to be this one. I haven't seen, I don't think anybody has gotten the pink diamond here in James Harden. But obviously, you know, he definitely has multiple cards. I always like him every year just because he's one of the taller point guards. I do want to see his animations, even though most likely it's going to end up being, yeah, normal release timing, James Harden lower upper, James Harden dribble style. He's definitely going to be saucy as well. I think, you know, comboing Harden 
and you know Edwards might not be too insane but I think if you can just manage to get Harden I think you'll have one of the best cards in the game in my opinion just because again he is 6'5 definitely like his size I do also want to take a look at of course you know the other players like Larry Bird 6'9 he's going to be uh let's see anything special with him 97 three-pointer 88 speed 80 driving dug 91 perimeter defense he's got some hall of fame badges as well he only has a sapphire outside of that the hidden gems one and then of course the hidden gems pink diamond so this is going to get updated i don't think i've seen anyone get uh the pink diamond hidden gems larry bird but he does have pro dribble style larry bird lower upper normal release timing larry bird for some reason hasn't really gotten much love in the past couple like years of 2k which is really strange because he is a legend you know like it's crazy to say that like edwards is better than larry bird when larry bird is a hall of famer and stuff like that you know what i mean so he'll definitely be one of those players that if you do get obviously it'll be larry bird the legend but i don't think he's gonna be as broken as he was you know originally even though he'll still be you know i mean he's six nine small forward seven one wingspan it all comes down to the release haven't tried out his sapphire this year so he'll definitely be something you know to just you have to test out yourself if you do get him of course and then we got to take a look at the other pd my boy granger up in here 6 9 and 90 speed 94 three-pointer granger always gets the cheesy animations you know that's what i mean like larry bird doesn't really get that love which is really weird 85 driving dunk 82 interior defense he'll definitely be you know another 6 9 small forward out there with some hall of fame badges limitless and dead eye on hall of fame i do want to see his animation as well just to see if we're cooking or not the haywood uh highsmith lower and upper interesting so normal he, ha uh, he has basic dribble style he does have the chris paul escape damian lillard uh crossover combos when it comes to him the anthony Edwards behind the back and vince carter step back i'm not 100 percent sure because this is the first granger we're gonna be seeing this year he doesn't have a lower tier card so i'm hoping that he definitely is pretty crazy but with normal release timing that's really gonna you know change certain players right because this release, I'm not too familiar with it. If you guys know if it's cheesy or not, let me know. Uh, you know, especially for this year, right? In previous two Ks, I think he had like what? Uh, was it base nine, base eleven? You know, it's crazy back back in those days in two K nineteen. So he's gonna be getting a new card as well. I think for him, him and Larry, you know, I'm really focused on James Harden. Honestly, like the only PD I want is James Harden. Even though we're also getting the legend, two K legend, Dolph up in here, six eight, power forward center. I don't like that just because he's undersized, but they usually tend to give him some cheesy animations. 93-pointer, 75 driving dug, 90 insert defense, 76 speed. Yeah, he'll definitely be a... Uh, let's see, it all comes down to those animations with 6A. Brook Lopez lower, mellow upper. Ah, so that release is definitely, again, normal still. I'm assuming they're waiting for Dark Matters to change that. But that release is looking promising though. The Lopez lower and mellow, you know, has some mellow yellow, favorite color yellow. So he could potentially be good. It just sucks that he can only play the power forward center position, especially since he is 6'8. But you could definitely, you know, put in some work, you know, with him. So that's going to be another pink diamond. And then, of course, we have my boy Rui up in here as a diamond, 6'8, you know, 90 speed, 89 three pointer, 90 driving dunk, 88 inter defense. I think he'll definitely be a good diamond that people can definitely pick up. I did see some people run, you know, Rui before, and in previous two games, he's been really good. He's one of those players that, you know, once you get his release down, he's money. So he's going to have his typical Rui lower upper. Still normal release timing, basic dribble style. He does have the James Harden crossover combos. Luka, you know, crossover, Chris Paul moving behind the back and so on. And so when it comes to Rui, I think he'll definitely be one of those players, especially him being a diamond. He definitely should be a little bit more affordable than, say, like the Opals and stuff like that. And I just double-checked and 2K still hasn't revealed the My Team Festival. So it could be coming out tomorrow or it could be coming out next week. I'll keep you guys updated, but let me know what you think about the new players. And if you want to see more, check out the first Opal I pulled. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.